it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot and I'm here to do a reading for Sagittarius this is for the week of August 10th through the 16th so the second week of August Sagittarius Sun Moon rising in Venus we're gonna see what comes up what do we got for Sagittarius I'm going to tag uh, the first week to the end. It seems to be pretty interesting. These all fell out, this whole little stack. You think I should just look at them? I mean, they fell out. I think I'm going to. Ooh, okay. It just fell right out of the deck. You, you will be receiving or giving a precious gift. Dog close up pleasure with a close friend. Coins, money will be coming to you. Bear, interesting, especially in money matters. So there's danger, danger. Valley, ooh, deep personal strength and peace that assures success. So deep personal strength, ooh. Mm. Chair, empty. Someone is leaving your life. Crown, honor, and respect will come to you. So that's a, quite a bit of information right there. Um, someone's leaving your life. Honor and respect is going to come to you. You are going to need deep per personal strength. Um, you're probably going to find peace with whoever's leaving your life. That may bring you some sort of peace. Uh, danger especially in money matters but it says especially it doesn't mean that it is incomplete it is definitely in money matters danger period a bear is dangerous so there's danger um, money will be coming to you diamond you will be receiving or giving a precious gift pleasure with a co close friend I feel like there's something happening uh, that may be pleasurable in the moment, but it's dangerous. Do you know what I'm saying? I think it's dangerous, and I think it's going to cost. Yeah, I'm not sure exactly what this is. Money's going to be coming to you, but I don't think it's in the best way. So that's interesting. What do we have for Sagittarius? Two of Swords reversed. The Hierophant, there's a higher power involved here. This is a god, a channeler, a healer, um, a mentor, so it could be a counselor. Uh, this is that could be dealing with a Taurus. It doesn't have to be. This two of swords reversed is uh, being torn. You may be torn between two directions. I think that uh, there could be an altercation. It looks like there's an altercation here. There's also it's torn between using your heart and using your head. There's a level of indecision here and being emotionally guarded. You may be having some sort of overwhelming worry or frustrations or anxiety. And it's something, this is like truth being exposed. Okay, there's a higher power involved. Could be a counselor, I'm not sure. Could be a priest. This is somebody that is in a position of authority. The Hierophant is the highest authority. It is ruled by Taurus. But it's anybody can take on this energy. Um, this person is uh, directly connected to a higher power. Um, but this Two of Swords reversed is something, some sort of exposure, okay? This is restrictions, okay? There's some sort of restrictions, but there's also... Um, it could be the you've been restricted, and maybe you're... you're maybe you've been restricting yourself. Um, this is seeing the truth, lies being exposed. So there, there is some sort of uh, lies that are being exposed. Mm. Nine of Cups reversed. And the Page of Swords. So I'm not sure if you're dealing, you could be dealing with um, 
an individual that is is telling something this person tells all they tell all they say something they uh, they're watching perhaps or they may have some sort of information that um, it's a mild conflict it's something you don't want to hear or you don't want said I feel like there's going to be something said it feels like whatever this is it, it may cause some sort of trouble the nine of cups reverse is dissatisfaction not happy somebody is overdoing it and they are overdoing it a lot and this could be have something to do with drinking um, because of all the cups okay uh, big mess because it looks like they're spilled you know there's a big big mess here to me it does look as though that is the case but the nine of cups reverse is lack of wish fulfillment this is not what you wished for this is not what you hoped for so um dissatisfied somebody is very dissatisfied the page of swords is difficult information it really is it's a message is coming and it's probably not what you want to hear it isn't what you want to hear um, I think you're going to be dealing with some mild conflicts this week. Somebody's been blocking, and but I think whatever they've been hiding or blocking, they can't hide it anymore. Um, the Empress. You could definitely be dealing with a Taurus. Now, this is a mother, okay? So it's either a mother or a father could be because this is I mean it could be a mother or a father could be both it, this is a child okay so there, you know, there could have something to do with a mother and a father and a child here um, but we have a mother who is in despair okay look at her she's in this she's not happy okay we have a mother that is worried okay she is definitely worried she's worried she's um, doesn't look very happy and I think it has to do about her child she's worried about her child and maybe this is lies being exposed so there could be somebody that is exposing some sort of lies oh my god and it is oh my god okay this is God this is the devil and this is oh my god so this is a oh my god moment this, you know, the devil in reverse could be extremes. We could have somebody here that goes to extremes. This could be extremely unhealthy, extremely toxic, definitely overindulging. Definitely. Somebody is overindulging. They, they can't uh, control themselves and they need to control themselves. But there is a higher power that is watching. There is, this is somebody in authority, whether it is God or whoever it is could be a counselor somebody is watching okay they are watching uh, they are watching this addiction or they are watching this uh, play out definitely watching somebody is, is watching the devil reverse is needing to take back control you must find it in you to take back control but I think it's too it, it feels like it's gone overboard the nine of cups reverse is going way too far and the devil reverse is going way too far as well this is the devil reverse is suffering despair weakness you must free yourself from this addiction this is things getting worse this is a deep deep dark place and you have to break free from it you do you do. And this could be a judge even. You know, I feel like so there is something that is going to happen, you know, that breaks you free from something that has kept you slave to it. You have been slave to this addiction. And I feel like you've been going overboard with it. Some, yeah. And addictions come in many forms. Addiction can be food. Addiction can be drugs. Any kind of drugs. Pills. Uh, pot. Uh, drinking um, any kind of drugs okay but it does there's definitely going overboard here Queen of Coins so this is about stability and the Queen of Coins is very practical very realistic very stable you may be dealing with a Taurus you could be dealing with a Taurus uh, mother okay this is Mother Earth you could definitely be dealing with a mother 
uh, or a mother figure. Anyhow, um, the Queen of Coins is, uh, she has, uh, she's very practical. She's very realistic. She's very loyal. She's very dependable. She's strong. She doesn't give up. She's a hard worker. She's very intelligent. So the Queen of Coins, and this could be, for some of you, this could be your energy, becoming stable. She's very stable, working on her own stability, working on uh, doing whatever it takes to build stability. Now this is um, having plenty. This Queen of Coins has plenty. She has plenty of money. She has plenty of stability. She's very solid and secure. Um, she's she's just happy. She's easy to get along with. She's down to earth. Um, we have Capricorn here. Taurus, Libra, Taurus, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. For a lot of you, you're dealing with an earth sign. But we could also be dealing with a Libra because we have Libra here a couple times. Um... There's going to be a message that is coming, or somebody is telling. This is telling. Somebody is, is, is saying something. Knight of Coins. Ten of Wands reversed. Balance is waiting. And the Ace of Wands. So the Ace of Wands is a new beginning. This is exciting. This is a new desire. It's a new flame. It's a new spark. This is an exciting opportunity for growth. Um, this is a new life. It really is. So there's an opportunity for a new life here. But this is releasing a burden, releasing baggage, dropping weight. Somebody may be dropping weight, you know, and they're not healthy. Um, because this is not healthy. This is The devil reversed is extremely not healthy. Um, But the Ace of Wands is a is a sudden desire to live, you know, a sudden desire to let go with the Ten of Wands reverse, a sudden desire to put in effort with the Knight of Coins. You may find it within yourself or, or something like that. Somebody, this is like having the desire to put in effort with the knight of put in work because the Knight of Coins is a worker. A lot of work here. Work, work. The Queen of Coins is about work. Work, 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 work. Okay, that's what Queen of Coins does. Okay, should do whatever it takes to bring stability. So that's what this week is about. It's about bringing stability into your life, releasing burdens, letting go of burdens. Your balance is waiting. And I feel like this week you are going to receive some sort of information or something is going to happen that is going to uh, enlighten you perhaps because of this knight of coins sets a goal okay decides to put in the hard work uh uses common sense wants stability decides that and this is desire desires stability so i feel like this week you are going to be letting go of something that you have been holding on to um, and it has to do with an addiction it does i think that there's been a and this is right in the middle okay your overall energy you've been in a deep dark place the addictions have uh, hurt you okay they've hurt you they're killing you And I feel like this week, now this is this is unconditional love. I mean, um, this is, the Empress is a mother's love. This is the birth of a new life. But you don't get the birth of a new life until you deal with the pain. And you've got to deliver that pain. And that pain is going to hurt. And it's not going to be easy. So I feel like this week you're going to be dealing with some sort of pain. And this pain, is it's really going to hurt. It's going to hurt. Something is going to hurt. Um, you're going to need to have faith. You're probably going to be receiving guidance from somebody. Maybe it's a counselor. Maybe it's God. Maybe it's your own gut. Okay? Because this is intuition. It's gut. So somebody's uh, higher power or a higher power is going to be guiding you towards a new life. Okay? But you're going to be putting in work. And I feel like you're going to be... Um, 
deciding to do it. It's like you, well, maybe you don't have a choice. This Ten of Wands reversed is making a conscious change. Somebody is going to be making a conscious change to drop something that has been weighing them down. This is freeing yourself. This is freedom. It is. And this one is too. Once you decide to deal with the pain of breaking free from whatever this addiction is. But I feel like before you do, there's going to be some sort of battle. There is going to be a battle. There's going to be a battle before you uh, break free from whatever this is that has kept you bound to it. You, are, you have been bound to it. Um, I do feel as though... Um, you do have a mother here, because you have mother, mother, here and here. Um, fortune, Wheel of Fortune, change. We have a cycle that is coming to an end in your life, okay? One chapter of your life is coming to an end. This is destined. You are destined for a better life. You are. So this is destined. This is a fated event. This is. This is fate. So there's some sort of fated event that uh, changes your destination. Okay, this is this is good luck. Good luck is on its way. This is the wheel of life. It is in this is the, the wheel of life is in constant motion. Life is always changing. Okay, positive change is coming for you. You this is God. Okay, this is a higher power and a mother. Okay, so there's a mother here. So there's a higher power that is changing your direction. They are put, they're going to put in effort. Somebody's putting in effort. And maybe they're giving you some sort of energy to put in effort. Maybe there's some sort of protection here. Okay, there's some sort of protection. Your life is about to change for the better. This is a whole new life for you. But this is a conflict. The Page of Swords is a conflict. You may be receiving news of legalities. You know, the Page of Swords, you know, somebody from the law may be stepping in. You're going to be regaining strength. This is a this is strength, courage, confidence, better health. Finding your ability and your strength and your your determination. I feel like you, there's or it's this person that is very determined because we this this queen of pentacles somebody is very strong somebody is very determined and i feel like they have a lot of love for you feels like they want to protect you i do feel like you are going to need to be brave this week This is letting go of burdens and regaining strength. Finding your strength to fight this addiction. Oh, justice reversed. Yeah, there's an imbalance here. There's there's there probably is some news of legalities and something may not go your way. Okay, there something may not go in your favor. Okay, when you get justice reversed, you may feel like this isn't fair. You may feel like, uh, how could this happen? You're not happy with the outcome. You know, uh, there's some sort of imbalance here. And there's dishonesty. But I feel like there's uh, a new life waiting for you. And even though you may feel, feel like this isn't fair, or you may feel like this is unjust... I feel like whatever is happening is moving you towards a better life. I feel like you are going to receive some news that uh, 
doesn't make you happy okay the nine of cups up reversed right here this is the news doesn't make you happy but you will find the strength within you to deal with it you will you will this is all about you gaining stability you will gain stability from this you may even get some sort of payout in the end okay there could be some money coming to you later on and then we saw that over there the queen of pentacles is a person that has a lot of money they get some sort of reward and this is a reward as well so i feel like you're going to be getting some sort of money you're going to be getting some sort of reward here when this is all said and done um but right now there's an imbalance with the justice reverse and something is not going to turn out the way that you should or that that you think it should okay this is uh legal losses or something in the legal system that is not going in your favor but it's because of the devil right here it's because of temptations it's because of uh addictions okay there's 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 consequences for um going overboard okay there's consequences for going overboard so i do feel as though um you're going to be doing a lot of thinking this week i think you're going to be doing a lot of maybe you're going to be thinking about your mother because this is thinking and this is a mother it is so, you know, I'm not sure what is going on. Maybe you're going to be thinking about what your mother, what your mother would want or what your mother wants. And that, that wheel of fortune is positive change, making a change and receiving some sort of money. You're going to be, and it could be the gift that we saw, receiving a gift from somebody. Okay. Um, this person has a lot of money and maybe they can help you. They can help you if you get help or whatever the case is. Yeah, I do see a new life here. This is the beginning of a new life. It really is with the Ace of Wands. There's an opportunity to live. There's an opportunity for growth. This is a time of, uh, it's a very passionate time. Although I feel like you're not going to be um, happy with whatever news that you receive. I don't think you're going to, you're not going to be. You're not going to be. Because it, it feels, and this is force. You may, I'm not sure if you're being forced to do something. Um, now, the strength card is, is about control. And it's right over the Queen of Pentacles. So somebody may be taking control. This person is very strong-willed. You are dealing with somebody that is very strong, very strong-willed. But as you can see, I feel like this person wants to protect you, you know. So anyway, what do we, this week, probably by, you know, at the beginning of the week, there is some sort of, there's been some sort of indecision, but the lies have been exposed at the beginning of the week. There's some sort of truth coming out, which changes your destination. There is either a counselor or a higher power involved. There's a change coming. One cycle of your life is coming to the end. You're about to start a new life, okay? In the middle of the week, there's, this isn't right. This isn't fair. I can't believe this is happening. Uh, this isn't, this is, this isn't fair. This isn't fair. This is this isn't fair. So you're going to maybe be saying that right in the middle of the week. I, I can't, I, this isn't fair. You know, you may be in denial. You may be in denial. Um, by the end of the week, I feel as though um, you're going to be finding your strength and your courage to deal with whatever this situation is. Um, you may even communicate with with this person. You may you may start communicating with whoever this person is over here. That um, I feel like somebody told on you or something. They told. They told. Um, Either way, this week you're going to be gaining your strength. You're going to be gaining strength that 
maybe some of you are really skinny, you know, or you're overweight. Could go. This is extremes. The ten of wands. It's either underweight or overweight. Okay, and there's something about weight here. And this is gaining, regaining health, working on your health. There's been some sort of addictions or it could be even ego that has gotten in the way of success. And there's been a lot of dishonesty and there's been a lot of lies. But this is a, a sudden, uh, I think there's a sudden decision because of this balance, this justice. This is a sudden decision. This is sudden. All of a sudden, things change. One more card. Page of Wands reverse. Now, for some of you, that may be your energy, but the Page of Wands reverse is somebody that doesn't follow through. Unreliable, boring, uh, negative, fails to launch. There's probably, you're going to probably receive some bad news this week. This is somebody who makes excuses, doesn't follow through ever. You know, somebody that is lazy gets distracted you know so I feel like uh, there's been a level of confusion and indecision and something's been hidden and I but and I feel like some some news is coming and it's whatever news is coming is going to you bet this is very very unbalanced needing to find balance. But anyway, whatever news is coming is going to uh, help you to let go. You're going to be dropping something that has been holding back your growth. It may seem like it's bad news, but this is destined to happen. And I know that this is kind of confusing. I think it's going to be a confusing week. You're going to be receiving bad news that you may say this isn't this isn't fair. This isn't fair. But this will change your life for the better. Endings lead to new beginnings. This is a profound change, destruction, destruction of the old you. This is a renewal. This is a transformation. It's an ending with a new beginning to follow. There's going to be a separation or a loss. This separation or a loss leads to a new life for you. Okay? So, Someone is leaving your life, but it is for the better. It is for the better. This is going to break you free from this cycle. Okay? It's going gonna, it's gonna to put you on a new path. It really is. You are going to be able to build stability now. Good luck.